Yeah, so I'm that is. Tom, have you got permission to come and do it? No, no permission. Well, can you not do it then? Thank you. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we're going to have a look around Everard's Logistics, Leicestershire. Small little site at the end of a, an industrial estate. I mean, behind me, they've got uh, a new little warehouse being built there. A few little warehouses dotted around. But Everard's uh, is very well known. So I thought we'd have a quick look at this one. You can see a tiger, tiger van down there in the distance. And loads of barrels of beer. Not sure what they do out of this uh, this warehouse, but let's go find out. Protected by Samsic. There's some nice, uh, nice things to see in the filing cabinet here. Some old beer pumps, if you recognise those brands. Publican. Just right, having a look around, really, seeing if there's anything interesting to get on the footage. That's quite nice, isn't it? Just doing a video, just general video. But Thank, you. Thank you. You're right, yeah. It's not open to the public, this place, is it? No. That's nice, though, isn't it? Yeah, so and that is. Tom, have you got permission to come and do it? No, no permission. Well, can you not do it then? Thank you. It's an open door. Just seeing anything yeah, interesting. This is a, like a business site. Yeah, yeah. Open to the public. Yeah, okay. I'll leave you to it. Okay. Morning. Morning. It's lovely, that is. Very impressed with that. And that up there, that's really nice, isn't it? It's a shame they're, be they're behind lock and key that the public can't see them. Well, we've got the shop over at Meadows. If you want to go over there, oh, you're welcome to go oh, over there. Oh, I this thought that was here. No, no, this is the, this is the warehouse. So if you want to go look all the Everard stuff, it's over at Meadows. Just, yeah? just direct me to that, please. Whereabouts? So if you go, um, head towards Boss Park. If you go back onto the M1, yeah. go straight off, and then you head towards Boss Park and you'll see the side. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay. So they have got a nearby Everard's building for visitors. That's good. We shall go and take a look. Oh, look what they've got here, the electric charging points. Are these free of charge? That's the question. I think they are. Oh no, they've got a little key slot. Little key slot in them. Big names, Everard, all the big names, Amazon, they always seem to have these uh, charging points for the, for the staff to use. Really, really good. Right, let's go and have a look at the other Everard's building that she mentioned. So we took that lady's advice and we found the bigger Everard's building. I like that. Park here to pick up your beer. <laughs> Click and collect only, that's brilliant. Click online, order your beer and come and collect it. Not <laughs> even got some, uh, what they call them, hoppers or whatever it's called. Like showing off the pieces here. Look at that. Tiger, if you know what it is. The barrel van, dating back to the 1980s. Our barrel van was a regular at local carnivals and events where its distinctive look certainly caught people's attention. Certainly does. That looks like a shop, is it? Uh, just looking around. Mm. 
mini kegs. Dark lager. Sun chaser. Ruby ale. Citrus and tropical. Got all the uh, the glasses that you could ever need. All Everard's branded. Tiger branded. Beacon Hill branded down there. Tiger Ale Chutney. Even got gin. Even got the uh, the Leicester Leicester Tigers colour on there, and the Leicester City football colour as well. Richard Richard the Third. Some, some Tiger merchandise. Says up there what they're brewing, look. Dark lager. Treacle toffee. Got their own little brewing station. Magnets. And in here they have their own on-site pub and restaurant type of thing. But this is popular. All see-through glass where you can see into the main main brewery area. Let's check the prices out down here in Leicester. A pint of Tiger, 3.85, pound ninety-five for a half, and pound thirty for a third of a pint. <laughs> a third of a pint. That's like if you have a tour, that's all locked in there. Welcome to the beating heart of our home. Where all the magic happens. We don't want to see any toilets, do we? <laughs> our journey began in 1849. Now in our sixth generation, over 170 years of brewing heritage. Now we have a great story to tell. Small batch. These beers are brewed using our small batch brewer. They are super limited so when they're gone they're gone try a pint while you can and that relates to this pump here 
tank ale and tank lager, which is linked to these tanks here. And it tells you when they were filled. Filled on the 8th of October, 488 litres. Filled on the 27th of September, 485 litres. Very impressive. Some nice noises coming from in here as well. Can't see any moving parts. You've got the beer hall, which we've just been into. The other entrance is there, maybe at night time when the shop's closed. And the shop, which we have already just seen. Let's have a look around the outside. Nice Everard's benches there. And what a lovely outdoor seating area. And as you would expect for a big company like Everard's, they do have these electric charging points. Tesla being charged up just there, look. I wonder if these are free. Charge Master, you got the key there. Ah, yeah, very good. And this is where you normally find people like me, around the back gate. What is there to see around the back? Not much. Not much at all. Not much at all. So that's it from Everard's. First we went to the wrong building, then we found this place. We had a good look around, very impressed. Nothing really, no confrontation really. They just let us get on with it, which is a good thing. So I hope you've liked this one and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Thanks for watching.